Good morning, Mr. Chan, Mr. Chan, Mr. Sung, teachers and fellow Hugovians. My name is Kanye. And I am Wei And we are from Class 1-4. And we, we are, are your MCs for Staff Appreciation Day 2020. This year, our annual Staff Appreciation Day concert goes virtual. Every year on this day, we take the opportunity to appreciate our teachers, school support staff and contract workers. This year, it will even be more meaningful for us as our teachers have to go through HBR with us during the circuit breaker. Indeed, really. The, the amount of work we have to go through just so that we could still continue with learning at home. Hugurans, I believe you will agree with us as well. So before we start, let's wish all staff a happy, happy appreciation day. First up, uh, we have a thank you teacher video. This video features parents' appreciation of teachers in light of COVID-19 and HBL. During HBL, parents were offered a window into our classroom and were able to better appreciate our teachers' contribution. They want to show their appreciation as they have noticed how we have grown. So thank you, Cher. To Miss Tan. Hello, Madam Huang. To my child's form teacher, Mrs. Maniam. Dear Mr. Rahim, I'd like to firstly apologize. Sorry I disagreed with you when you told us Chun Kiet can sometimes be a handful. Be careful with the scissors, Nila. After two months of home-based learning, I don't just agree. I fully agree. Hi guys! I was really surprised when you invited a real doctor to class. And that Selena is brave enough to ask that many questions. Thank you for all that you do and all that you try to do in new ways. It was funny to see Nila running around the house measuring our floor area for mats. It's not easy to engage kids these days. I think when we look back on this, it was indeed a tough time. But our teachers, were tougher. So when our children went back to school, I couldn't help but feel a sense of relief. Relief that my daughter has the strong support of a caring teacher. And relief that my son is under your watchful eye. To Madam Huang, Miss Tan, Mrs. Maniam, Mr. Rahim, and all the teachers of our generation, thank you. Now, I would like to invite our students' performance. To start off, we have our first performance. Erika O, 4 9 with Alicia, 3 7 on the piano, titled 10,000 Hours. Friends at a party When's your favorite song Doesn't make you smile Do you think of me When you close your eyes Tell me what are you dreaming Everything I want to know it all I'd spend 10,000 hours And 10,000 more Oh, if that's what it takes To learn that sweetheart of yours And I might never get Try if it's ten thousand hours or the rest of my life, I'm gonna love you. Do you miss the road that you grew up from? Did you get your middle name from your grandma? When you think about your forever now, do you think of me? When you close your eyes, tell me. Spend 10,000 hours and 10,000 more Oh, if that's what it takes to learn that sweetheart of yours And I might never get there But I'm gonna try If it's 10,000 hours or the rest of my life I'm gonna love you I'm gonna love you Everything in between Gotta kill my curiosity I 
might spend ten thousand hours and ten thousand more. Oh, if that's what it takes to learn the sweetheart of yours, and I might never get there, but I'm gonna try. If it's ten thousand hours or the rest of my life, I'm gonna love you. I'm gonna love you. Especially Mrs. Lee Shuan Lee for always trying her best every day to make her lessons more engaging for us. And also Mrs. Patricia Tan, my math teacher, for always being such a hardworking teacher, especially for a And I also like to thank Mr. Ezra. I'd like to thank all my previous form, co form, and subject teachers for guiding me whenever I was in doubt. Happy Appreciation Day! Thank you for all your efforts! <laughs> thank you, Erica and Alicia, for the wonderful performance. Our next performance, Shakira 3-8 with Aulia 2-4 performing on the guitar with a song, Stay Gold. In a world where you feel hollowed, you gotta stay gold, baby, yeah. Together we're under this moonlight, I still can fall asleep tonight. See right into your heart and I'm sneaking up on you and I'm playing hide and seek I hope you see that I'll be right there before you even know when I fell in love with you Hope you didn't notice it You were so pure and so kind and yours they shine like bright diamonds More than any treasure in the world you are so beautiful You make me feel like no matter what I can't take my eyes off of you no more When time sees you even it will just cease to move and watch you
Hey teachers, thank you for being there for us, supporting us in anything that we do, and helping us get through school and examinations. Happy Teachers Day! That's a big one note. Thank you, Shakira and Oya. The next item is an appreciation video that was put together by the Student Council of 2020. A big thank you to all the classes who have submitted your videos. So sit back and enjoy the clip. Hello everyone, we are the Exco of 2020. We hope you all know that we cherish and appreciate you. That's right, we don't show sure it, but we do. Thank, thank you and happy appreciation, appreciation day! Oh. My favorite teacher is Miss Kwa because she is a very nice teacher who cares a lot about her students and she has also put my grades up from a fail to an A1 in geography which is something I'm really grateful for but I also feel that all teachers are amazing and should be appreciated so happy Teachers Appreciation Day! Thank you teachers for all that you have done for us we truly appreciate what you have done and although we may have caused you struggles, we may have caused you pain, we truly appreciate what uh, the effort that you put into teaching us um, and giving us knowledge. Um, so from, from me, happy Teacher's Day. I may not always say it, but I mean it whenever I say it. Thank you Ms. Nosinda, Mr. Yang and all the other teachers that have taught me for all the extra efforts you make to help me grow and the challenges you encourage me to face to help me become who I am today. On the behalf of all my other friends in 17, we wish you a happy teacher day. Hello, Miss Mas, and happy Teacher's Day. Thank you for teaching me and, and for all your support. It really helps me go through our tough times in the school years. Thank you, Mr. Tam and Miss Sue, for all your efforts during HPL. Thank you, Mr. Sia, for being an amazing teacher. Thank you, Mr. Nisa, Nisa. Thank you, teachers. Thank you, teachers. Hello, Mr. Tom and Miss Sue. Thank you, Miss Sue and Mr. Tom. Happy Staff Appreciation Day and thank you to teachers of 1 4 for all of their hard work. Teachers out there, happy Teachers Day. Thank, thank you, and we wish you a happy Teachers Day. Thank you, and we wish you a happy Teachers Day. is a virtual choir. It features combined voices of about 300 students from 280 schools in Singapore. They will be performing an original composition by a music teacher entitled You Are The Reason. The performance is meant as a symbolic tribute from all students to their teachers.
That was truly an amazing performance by the students. Now we have almost come to the end of our segment. One last item is the time where our teachers renew their commitment to the profession and mark their statement of belief through the taking of the teacher's pledge. The teacher's pledge. We, the teachers of Singapore, pledge that we will be true to our mission to bring out the best in our students. We will be exemplary in the discharge of our duties and responsibilities. We will guide our students to be good and useful citizens of Singapore. We will continue to learn and pass on the love of learning to our students. We will gain the trust, support and cooperation of our parents and the community so as to enable us to achieve our mission. We have now come to the end of the e-concert. Hope everyone had fun. Before we hand over to our teacher MC, once again, Happy Staff Appreciation Day! Bye! Bye. <laughs> Hello students, this is Miss Tra speaking, and together with me is Miss Tan, and we will be announcing the winners for GEMS Awards. We will be announcing the winners for the various categories we voted for, namely Mokja, most inspiring teacher, most innovative staff, and service excellent award. I am sure you hope that the staff will nominate the performance. Besides the categories mentioned, we will also be announcing the winners for best value added subjects for 4E, 4NA, and 4NT. Alright, let's start with announcing the winners for the most caring teacher award. So, Ms. Chua, honestly, I am not sure. I think there are many teachers who truly care for the students. Okay, and today we will be awarding five exceptional ones for their care towards the students. Let's hear what students have to say about the first award. She always makes sure that everyone understands the topic before moving on. She may be strict at times, but she still brings out the best in everyone and makes a fun and interesting lesson. She teaches us not to give up when we don't understand the math problems. She will help us break it down and make it easier for you. She cares not only for our aggregates but also our collector. Who is this math teacher, Ms. Tan? It is our very own math teacher who also played a pivotal role during HBL period as a ICTHOD, Madam Lee Lee Lin. Congratulations once again to Madam Lee. Let's hear what students have to say about the second dinner. She is a very daring and warm teacher who manages students with unique ways. He has different ways to make things work. There was once when my dad caught him because my dad thought I wasn't doing my normal self. He came up to me doing art and gave me some advice and comforted me after I told him about my situation. He's a great listener and a very kind teacher. Can you guess who this daring warm teacher is, students? It is none other than our Mr. Tio E. An. Congratulations, Mr. Tio! Next, who do we have? Okay, so um... She shows concern towards students and asks about our well-being. When she teaches, her explanations are very clear and she makes sure that everyone understands what she taught. When one do not understand, she takes time to explain to him or her. Her constant advice makes me feel motivated to score higher and also do well in there. Oh, another math teacher. So who is she, Ms. Trump? It is our very own Miss Lee Zi Yi. Congratulations, Miss Lee. Okay, let's see who do we have next. She is kind and helpful and will always bring humour to the class no matter rain or shine. If she spots any of us not being our usual self, she will ask us whether something is wrong. She will always try to make things easier for us so it will not be so stressful. She is very patient, she cares about us and does not scold us unnecessarily. And this very patient and caring teacher is none other than Miss Amethyst Ng. Mm. Congratulations Miss Amy! Now this is what student the last award winner. He is always patient in teaching and never gives up on us. He also cares for our well-being and writes postcards to wish us good luck for our exams. Truly a very caring teacher that would go to the extra mile to provide students with his support. Um, so this comment is written by this student in uh, Chinese. So I'm just going to do a translation. Okay. Basically it says, um, when I was about to give up on Chinese, he has never given up on me or any of my classmates. So I'm very thankful to your guidance okay, and your care and concern. You are a teacher that I will never forget. 
this student even dedicated his speech to this gem Mandarin, showing that he really appreciates the teacher, who is none other than Mr. Kok Wang Ling. Congratulations, Mr. Kok! Congratulations to all five caring teachers who made such an impact on students' lives. Let's view the one and only most inspiring teacher award. Teachers who can teach are many, but how many of them can inspire us to do better and actually like what we are doing? So let's hear what the students have to say about this teacher who managed to inspire the many around her. She inspires me to learn my geography better and to strive for better marks. She also teaches us core values which inspires me to be a better person. She never fails to encourage us and to compliment us when we do well. She has certainly motivated us to take our work seriously. Ah, a geography teacher and also our very own humanities teacher. So a round of applause for Miss Kwa, please. Through HBL, the education landscape is changing. Teachers have to craft lessons, teach study, and deliver us lessons in creative ways. Teachers are therefore also innovators. Who are the most innovative staff amongst us? Let's see. Okay, so um, she always makes changes in her way of teaching my class, and most of us enjoy the interesting resources. Her method of teaching really makes the class feel prepared for examinations. She is creative, encouraging, supportive, and helpful. She's a cheerful and very fun teacher creating jokes to make us laugh and enjoy her lessons more. A creative teacher, could it be a subject that also encourages lots of creativity? Yes, and that's none other than Miss Amanda Su. Congrats, Miss Su! It's not just arts related that encourages innovation. I'm sure all the subjects can be taught innovatively to help students understand the subject quickly. And this is what the next awarding managed to achieve. When we don't understand, you will find different ways to help us better understand by taking us to the lab or using classroom items to demonstrate this point. A very engaging teacher who always managed to make learning fun for us by doing impromptu demonstrations in class or joking with us. The way he teaches makes me feel like I want to do better myself because through his teaching, I see the world in a whole new way. Oh, interesting. So who is this teacher that managed to innovate different ways of teaching? That's Mr. Jonathan Ho. Congrats, Mr. Ho. It is not just important to acknowledge teachers, but also the many other staff that make you go for good learning environment by providing their services. For example, the cleaners who sanitize the place, the canteen vendors who provide you food, the IT representatives who assist you with your technical difficulties. The following awardees are recognized for their service excellence and contributions to school. He greets us with a bright smile every day. Whenever there is a problem, he tries his best to find a solution for us and help to the best of his ability. Like when it rained during the open house, he immediately got us umbrellas to shelter the parents. When we face issues with venues, spaces and equipment, he will try to resolve our issues as soon as possible. He's very amicable, helpful and prompt. This person who always tries to help students have a smooth experience in school is none other than Mr. Quack, our very own OM. Congrats, Mr. Quack! The next person is also very important, as without him, many things cannot function in school properly. So, Ms. Chua, do you want to guess who he is? Hmm, I'm not sure, but all I know is students have to say this about him. He always helps Hugo Vians with computer problems even during the holidays. If our class faces technical difficulties, he will straight away come and solve the problem. He always ensures that help get to colleagues in time. He is knowledgeable and makes conscientious efforts to keep himself updated. Always supportive and enthusiastic and encouraged. And this person is none other than Mr. Samir. A round of applause for Mr. Samir, please. We also want to acknowledge the teachers who pushes their students and help them understand the subject. These teachers help their students achieve excellence in the subjects they teach. The best value added subject for E stream is additional math. We would like to thank the following teachers Mr. Ng mm Chun Choi, Ms. Chong Mu Chu, and Mrs. Patricia Tan for their contributions. For the 4 and A stream, the best, best subject is humanities, which includes social studies. Geography and History. It is only possible because of the following humanities teacher. Mr. Silva, Mrs. Magdalene Piopo, Mr. Puga who teaches Social Studies, Mrs. Amanda Tan, Mrs. Agnew who teaches Geography, and Mrs. Prendian who teaches History. Thank you all for doing a 4 years of the best humanities experience. 
Lastly, for the 4M tea stream, the best performing is basic Chinese. We would like to thank Ms. Sengin Tan for her dedication to the 4M tea students and helping them to do well in Chinese. We are coming to the end of the award presentation. We would like to play all the winners once again. And we all know that the best reward is not this, but seeing our students have the best. I'm sure this is what all the winners had in mind when they did what they did. Thank you all once again and a happy Teachers Day. Now I'll pass over the time to Mr. Dale who will release you all.